again, I'm, I'm a fantasy school, so I'm going to show you, as I promised, how to solve this beast of a puzzle. It's called Colossus. It's a 24 cell puzzle. Uh, you cannot see the octahedron cells because um, it's scrambled. I did a mistake and I scrambled it. However, I know how to put it back. And I'm going to demonstrate this in this video. I'll try to do it as fast as I can. So, those Those puzzles, these four-dimensional puzzles, are, are, have some excellent symmetry. But this one, the one I'm solving right now, has the best symmetry of all. Because it contains um, some, it has the property of duality, number one. And it's also related to the property of triality. The property of triality is nothing more or less than combining three vector fields. In the case of duality, there is two vector fields. In the case of triality, we have three. So, um, to put it in other words, just to give some examples, um, for the triality case, uh, the 24 cell, this one, is made out of four hypercubes, which they share some corners, sorry, three hypercubes, and, and, and in the other way, it's made out of um, three 16 cells. So only by that, someone can realize that it's, it has an amazing symmetrical property. This has to be done step by step. As you can see, it's very tedious. Most important is to hold this puzzle by its corners or the rest of the puzzles. Otherwise, it, the telescopic rods they are strong, just, just, just like the connectors, but um, you, you need to consider that um, the telescopic rods become weaker at the thin parts. So we need to be a bit careful when we move them around so that there won't be any accidents. Hopefully by doing this manipulation, you will clearly see where each piece goes separately. And uh, I'm almost done here, but I need to do some extra last manipulation. I need to increase all the rods. The purple color will be outside. Now. At the top, we have a nice blue pyramid, blue octahedral, octahedron. So now we have the blue octahedron from at the top. Because when one color is outside, the corners are connected to colored Colored um, octahedrons inside. This is the green one. Green one done, blue one done. Now, let me do the black one now, which is over here. The black one is done. Sometimes you have to redo the blue ones because they're all connected in some twisted way. The brown one. The blue one, the green one, the white one, just to go a bit outside. And that will actually reveal the middle one, which is yellow color. So at the top, 
there is a white octahedron. At the bottom, there is a black one. Okay, this is, a, this is a, the black one here. This is the blue one here. This is, at the, at the front, there is the red one. The red one. The green one, the brown one, the white one at the top. And in the middle, there is the yellow one. And as you can see, it's solved now. It still looks scary. On the, on the outside, it's always purple, the outside um, edges of the octahedron. And one of the best properties that this puzzle has is you can actually make it two-dimensional and put it in your bag and bring it with you. It's, uh, um, it has some interesting um, properties. Anyway, it doesn't fit in my pocket, but still. And when you open it again, it becomes impressive. So this is the 24 cell. I hope you enjoyed the video. It's the most remarkable puzzle with the most remarkable symmetries. Thank you for watching.